How's that, Gov? Yes, Tinker. That'll do very nicely. Thank you. What do you think, Mrs. Bardell? Why, ask me. I'm just the general dog's body around here. Just one more item, Mr. Rabazzle, Mr. Just Mr. one more item, Mrs. B. Don't you know what this is? It's the portrait of a lady. A Venetian lady. Oh, a lady, is it? A Venus lady, did you say? One of them foreign asses, I got no doubt. Still, she got more clothes on than some other tell. What you can see of it looks as like you could do with a good scrub with soap and water. Not to say a few drops of carbolic. Carbolic? An old master like Chintaro. Tinker, Tinker, you're over-enthusiastic. It's only a copy. Only a copy? A 500 guineas, I'd rate it as gold dust. The original stolen last year at the Palazzo Medici was worth, at a modest estimate, 50,000 guineas. 50,000 guineas for a job of paint? Cool, some people don't know what to do with their money. Some people don't. I'm afraid Mrs. B doesn't approve. Is uh, that why you bought it, Governor? Hmm? Well, you know, I remember how cut up you were when you read about the robbery. To tell you the truth, I half expected to find ourselves on the next boat train out to see what we could do about it. Yes, and we might well have done just that, but we were otherwise occupied, if you remember. Yeah, on that diamond smuggling case. Yeah, that was a good one. But what about the picture, the original one? Was it ever found? Uh, no, not yet. Proper mystery, eh? Yes, as you say, a proper mystery. And there's another in the agony column of the Times. If the person who purchased a copy of the portrait of a lady from the Fitzroy Gallery will contact Margrave 3174, he will hear something to his advantage. Yeah, well, that's us. W well, you, anyway. What do you think it means, then? Well, there's only one way to find out, isn't there? Oh, hello, operator. Margrave 3174, please. Ring in. Oh, hello, Margrave 3174. Hang on a minute, Sexton Blake here for you. 